and welcome to another edition of Nuisance of the Week. Yeah, I'm actually into it early, right? Anyways, um, today we're going to talk about something called space management. And I'm not talking about like the space on your computer or something. I mean that kind of space. Yeah, we talked about this, kind of sort of talked about this before with the digital versus physical argument. But mm, this goes into something else. I'm not talking about the. Uh, I'm not talking about some, some things that can be transferred digitally, although it's certainly not limited to them. I'm talking about the things that you might be collecting that could take up potentially a lot of space. Now, again, not limited to books, but mainly I'm talking about those ridiculous little statues, or maybe, or heck, maybe books. Maybe books, statues, posters, uh, paint, paintings, things that you've made, maybe. It doesn't matter. These, co oh, these collections... Like this one here, like this one here. <laughs> they're like all oak wook figurines or something like that. They're pretty awesome looking, I gotta say. Whoever's collection it is, this belongs to kudos. I love what I am seeing. And and sorry if this and sorry if I'm not using your your imagery without permission. It just kind of came up in the Google search. But there's a reason. It's impressive. But look how much space it takes up. It doesn't really matter whether it's something, something matte, something like oak wood, or maybe you got, some, maybe there's something heartfelt that you wouldn't feel bonded to. I like all these characters. My point, my point is that these things take up a lot of space, or at least they can. And I'm not going to tell you, and I'm not going to tell people to stop. Heck no. Sometimes seeing these collections, these things like this, sometimes they're the only things that can help keep us sane in, in this world. And that's something you can't trade for anything else. But of course, it does lead to a problem when you got an entire room filled with this one thing, and you're, and you still and wish to continue adding on. We can't keep doing. We can't keep doing this. Space management is is a serious problem, and I'm not really sure if there's an actual solution. But it is kind of annoying when you got a collection, when you got a collection of your favorite thing, whether it be, uh, stat, whether it be statues, figurines, or plushes. Doesn't matter what it is, really, and you're running out of space for it. This thing, whatever it is, obviously means a lot to you, and you're running out of space for it. I remember once upon a time when I was collecting something, uh, something I made, I made a decision to not and to stop at a particular point, and it actually hurt. Eventually, I was able to get a job, and I was able to start picking back up on it again. But for the longest while, it hurt a lot, and I don't want to see, and I don't want anyone else to go through that same feeling. That being said, I'm not in charge of your life, and I don't know what's going on. Maybe you have no choice but to put down that thing, put down that thing for a little while. At least it'll always be there. Part that really hurts is when you're forced to sell it. Hopefully that will never come to any of you. Obviously, I have no solution for this. This is just simply kind of a nuisance. But maybe it's a nuisance that we can learn to live with given the significance of whatever it is that we might be collecting. Anyhow, thank you guys for watching. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button. And be sure to subscribe if you want to see more stuff. And hit that little bell icon so you'll be notified when new videos are up. Whether it be me or Jim. In the meantime, this has been Nooses. I'm Ichi and this has been Nuisance of the Week. Take care and I'll see you next time.